bending your knees and coming into constructive rest position. Make sure your tailbone is nicely adjusted, your hands resting on your diaphragm. Spread those elbows wide to allow yours to release back into your mat. Feel those shoulders let go and roll back into your mat. Feel your breath beneath your hands. The fullness of your breath in and the fullness of your breath out. How good it feels to breathe in fully all that oxygen, prana, life force energy. And to breathe out fully and to let go of the unwanted energy, to release the carbon dioxide, creating that perfect balance. Interlace your fingers. Turn your palms facing up and push your palms to the ceiling. Nice easy stretch, a nice release for your fingers. And take your arms back behind you. And bringing your hands back on to your diaphragm, your feet together, and draw that left knee into your chest. Interlace the fingers and place them at the back of your knee. We'll just do some of our release movements this morning. Begin to move your foot slowly toward the ceiling. Keep the thigh on your chest. It's only your knee that's actually working here. Just a slow, gentle movement. Always that constant flow of breath. And just double check that you're relaxing your low back into your mat, that you haven't tensed up that lower area. Just keep this area nice and open as you create this movement. Release work is about going deep down into the tissue and releasing. It can be just energy, it can be tightness, it can be old injury that causes blocked energy. Slow movement with breath goes deep. Then just holding the leg up. Breathe freely as you hold. Feel the stretch through the back of the leg. Keep the thigh on your front body. And release. Hands around your knee. Just begin to move the knee a little from side to side. Start off small movements and increase the movement as your hip releases, softens. Nice, slow, easy movement, a sense of Going deep into the hip, deep into the tissue, softening and opening up.
taking the knee all the way over to the left and hold, going deep into the groin, releasing through the lower back. Breathe and relax. Coming back to centre, bring your foot back onto the floor, Gather the knees together, adjust your tailbone, draw the right knee to your chest, interlace your fingers, place them at the back of your knee and rest for a moment, relaxing those muscles you're connected with. Begin the movement, your foot moving toward the ceiling and slowly moving down again. Nice easy breaths with the movement. Time your foot is extended, hold, breathe and stretch. Keep the knee bent. And release, hands around your knee. Begin movement from side to side, start off small. Let's listen to your body as you feel the release in your joints and muscles. Move a little deeper, move a little wider, sorry, from side to side. Leg out to the right, opening deep into the groin and to the low back, the hip, breathe and relax. center, bring your foot back to your mat, <coughs> adjust your tailbone, nice deep breath, draw your heels close to your buttocks, we rest, let's move into our butterfly pose and relax in this posture.
If you wish, you can interlace your fingers, place them at the back of your head, and as you hold the butterfly pose, you can draw your chin to your chest if you wish. Head back to your mat, <clears throat> arms out shoulder level, rolling your right knee across to your left knee, looking along your right arm and relax into the spinal twist. Bringing your right arm up and over to your left arm so your hands are together, your body is on its side. <coughs> Breathe in, let the arm float up following your hand with your eyes and breathing out and your arm floats back, cross to the right and breathing in, floating the arm up and breathing out, floating the arm down. So a slow, easy movement with your breath. Wonderful feeling of not only opening up the upper body, but energy and blood flow into the upper body. It's working with the organs as well. And next time your arm is extended out to the side, Hold, and we're bringing one leg at a time back up to centre. Come back into alignment and then rest in butterfly pose. Moving your left leg across to the right leg along your left arm and rest in the polycene through the spine. Slowly moving your left arm up and across so your hands are together. Then breathing in, your left arm floats up, your eyes follow the hand as you breathe out, your arm floats back. The inhale floating up, the exhale floating down, find your own rhythm.
time your arm is outstretched, just hold. Bring your one time back to centre. Bring your hands back onto your diaphragm. Adjust your tailbone. Bring yourself back to alignment. And draw both knees into your chest, into Winverley pose. Actually, let's interlace the fingers and place them at the back of the knees. Hold, breathe, relax, a nice soothing pose bringing energy into your abdomen the organs muscles into your digestive system and let's just keep the thighs to the chest and move your feet toward the ceiling working with both legs now slowly easy movement and even work the movement with breath if that feels comfortable for you. Holding the stretch. And release heels to your butt, to your thighs, hands around the knees. Gently rock from side to side. And back to centre. Open the knees a little wider. Arms on the insides of your legs. Hold on to your feet or ankles. Just stretch the legs up. Opening them about hip width. Breathe freely as you hold. that stretch from the base of the spine through the legs. If you're comfortable bringing your chin to your chest, you can add that to the pose. back down, bend your knees, rest with breath and as you rest move your head gently from side to side, a nice soothing movement for your neck, gentle releases, And back to centre. Knees still wider apart. Arms back behind you. Take a breath in. As you breathe out, you're bringing your arms up and forward in between your knees and your chin comes to your chest. So you're pushing your hands away to open up the upper back, the neck. Breathe in, bringing your arms up, head back, breathe out, arms down. So we do an inhale, exhale on the movement. So inhale, exhale, coming up and forward, stretching those arms away. 
moving deep into our abdominal muscles. Breathing in, breathing out, coming back down. So I want you to find your own rhythm with breath and movement. It's knowing you're going deep into the belly, going into those muscles that are underneath the superficial abdominal muscles, there's muscles underneath that are, we hardly get to. So this particular movement goes that little bit deeper into those muscle groups. One more cycle. When you've finished your cycle, bring your knees together, hands around your knees and rest in one relief pose, soft, gentle breathing. Your heels. Come down onto the floor, hip width apart and close to your buttocks. Just your head under a little. Just to give your neck a stretch the other way and also to stretch your throat. Take your head back, back of your head on the mat. Arms down beside your body, breathe out. Inhale, drawing your arms up and back at the same time, lifting your body to the ceiling as you come into your bridge pose. Just coming as high as is comfortable. Breathe freely as you hold. Gently roll from your upper back, vertebra by vertebra, all the way down to the base. Bring your arms back down beside your body. Rest with breath. 